Once upon a time, in a vibrant kingdom known as Valorantia, there lived a young prince named Leo. He was known for his compassionate heart and sharp intellect, but he lacked the one quality that would define his true potential, courage. In Valorantia, courage was revered as the greatest virtue. It was said to be the key that unlocked doors to endless possibilities and allowed individuals to overcome any obstacle. The kingdom thrived on the bravery of its people, who dared to dream big and pursued their ambitions with unwavering determination. Leo admired the valor displayed by his subjects, but couldn't help but feel inadequate. He yearned to possess the same courage that ignited their spirits, propelling them forward. Determined to discover his own reservoir of bravery, Leo embarked on a quest to learn the true essence of courage. He sought the wisdom of an old sage who resided in the enchanted forest on the outskirts of the kingdom. The sage, known as Elysia, was revered for her profound knowledge and her ability to unlock the secrets of the human spirit. Upon meeting Elysia, Leo poured out his heart, confessing his longing for courage and his desire to become a leader worthy of his kingdom. Elysia smiled warmly, her eyes gleaming with wisdom, and she imparted upon him a profound truth. Courage, young prince, is not the absence of fear, she said, her voice carrying the weight of centuries of wisdom. It is the conscious choice to act despite fear, to rise above doubts and uncertainties, and to trust in oneself. Leo pondered her words, realizing that courage was not an innate quality possessed only by a few, but a flame that could be ignited within anyone. Elysia then presented Leo with a challenge. He must journey deep into the heart of the treacherous dragon's den and retrieve a precious artifact, a symbol of courage hidden within. With newfound determination, Leo set off on his perilous quest. Fear clung to him like a heavy cloak as he ventured into the depths of the den. The ground quaked beneath his feet, and the flames of the dragons roared, testing the limits of his resolve. In those moments of doubt, Leo remembered Elysia's words and summoned his inner strength. He acknowledged his fears, but refused to let them control him. Step by step he pressed forward, fueled by a burning desire to prove his courage. Finally, after overcoming numerous trials, Leo stood face to face with the fierce dragon guarding the artifact. The dragon's fiery breath sang the air, but Leo remained steadfast. He drew upon the essence of his newfound courage and faced the beast with unwavering determination. In a display of bravery and quick thinking, Leo outwitted the dragon and retrieved the artifact, a shining crystal that pulsated with energy. As he held it in his hands, he felt a surge of courage coursing through his veins, merging with his very being. Returning to the kingdom as a transformed prince, Leo shared his story with his people. He spoke of the importance of courage, not only in the face of danger, but in every aspect of life. He taught them that courage is the catalyst for growth, the fuel that ignites dreams, and the key to unlocking their true potential. Inspired by Leo's journey, the people of Valorantia embraced their own fears and pursued their aspirations with newfound vigor. The kingdom blossomed with innovation and creativity as its citizens discovered the immense power of courage within themselves. And so, the story of Leo's quest to find courage became a timeless tale of inspiration. It reminded all who heard it that courage is not the absence of fear, but rather the choice to act despite fear, to believe in oneself, and to embrace the limitless possibilities that lie beyond the realm of comfort.